Chinese fish with coleslaw and fries. Plasticware. And another cocktail sauce. This is what it's looking like. Oh, I got four hush puppies. because I think I had cocktail sauce in the last video too. So, I don't want to speak too soon, but I think I might have a job. Sort of like a trainer, like people come in that get hired and I train them. some tartar. But uh, yeah, so that position was at the neighborhood Walmart and then I had the regular Walmart contact me about a uh, automotive technician position. much about cars. I know more about electronics and stuff like that, but they would have certified me and took me to school. It was 17 an hour, but it would have been in the daytime, so I don't know. I just had a lot to think about. There's pros and cons to every job. Between you and me, I feel like 25 an hour to be in a management position and train people sounds pretty good, no matter what time of the day or night it is. So, they contacted me today. I had the interview yesterday, but they called me back immediately and said that they wanted to, uh, go ahead and move for, for move, move forward. I want to try to say further. They wanted to move further with the position. 
position. So they sent me the job offer. I accepted it, of course. And now I'm just waiting to hear it back. Because, you know, part of the uh, hiring process, I mean, I guess it really depends on where you're from, but here in America and Georgia, you have to complete a background check. Usually you do a drug test. And that's really about it. This fish is really good. But we'll see what happens. I just thank God and I thank you guys for the support. few weeks of, uh, it's been really tough, especially as a single father. I think I might mix some of this battered, these battered pieces inside of the coleslaw. This is a cod, by the way. Fish. I like all types of fish, though, but... This is kind of like the standard at Captain D's, I guess. <laughs> Which reminds me of a funny story. met my biological father at Captain D's, where she worked. Uh, apparently it was her first job. She was a waitress. And my biological father was a cook. One thing led to another. Somebody's order must have got served, because here I am. <laughs> made sure me and my brothers looked all nice and tight for school. <laughs> this is embarrassing, but I remember one year, I was in sixth grade.
most of the guys in school thought that it was badass. But I remember this other girl. Her name was Jensie. She was, um, she was friends with Jody and also played on the same soccer team. And she kept making fun of me. She's like, Matt, why do you have the letter M in the back of your head? Like, people can't remember your name or something. And then I remember Jody like, standing up in front of the class. And she was like, he could shave the whole alphabet in the back of his head. He's still going to be fine to me. Or maybe she didn't say fine, but, you know. And that just made me feel so good. Because that was like the first compliment that I ever got from a female. Or at least that I can remember. But I was like, wow. I never did do that again, though. Which is funny, because nowadays you see people that get like the Nike check shaped in the side of their head. And different shapes and patterns, which is cool. Just not a letter of the alphabet. <laughs> I'm making a mess. I hope you guys enjoyed my last video. I made it 30 minutes, uh, which is like double than most of my videos, maybe even triple length. That's a great dinner. Or lunch, rather. What are you guys eating today? since that comment about the sucking in sounds when I eat I've been trying to be more mindful but I can't help it <laughs> must not be too much of an issue if people are watching right
this man is passed out in his mother's arms like <laughs> all these loud noises and Dolby digital surround sound all that didn't phase him at all so she lifted up the armrest and laid him out and put his jacket over him and then he woke up like the last 15-20 minutes still nice to get out of the house though. She's been helping me out a lot while I can't find a job. I'm trying to look at least. Because the point is you try. It's all that matters. this little napkin. Shout out to you. Thank you very much. <laughs>